What up, y'all? So, today, we will be reacting to CJ So Cool uh, drama that he been sending. Hold on. What the fuck is they talking about? Hold on. Y'all, supposedly, so I'm supposed to be going to uh, Atlanta probably this Friday, y'all. Um, I had a family member or whatever that just passed away. Um, I talked to y'all a little bit in the last video about it. So, uh, we probably gonna pull up on her. So, um, yeah, I'm just... Y'all, it's a lot of shit going on right now. I need to go fake. Like, it's a lot of shit going on right now. And I genuinely don't, I genuinely like, I, I just, I'm just like, okay. You feel me? Like, I genuinely just like, okay. You feel me? Let me see something real quick though. Hold on. Y'all, we finna get some reaction video, but hold on. But, um, yeah, so we finna go on ahead and get into this reaction video. So let me just pull this shit up real quick. Because I've seen, um, basically, long story short, I've seen that, um, CJ so cool is getting, like, accused of touching Jaleel or something. You feel me? So we finna see what they talking about. Um, y'all know one thing about them K, she keep it real. You feel me? Everything on my channel is real. It's real life. I never cap. I never... I never do none of that shit. Anything that I say, bro, I stand on it, and it's always facts. You feel me? Anything that I've ever said on this bitch is always facts. It's always the truth. I don't have to lie about shit. This is just what it is. You feel me? But we finna go on ahead and react to this video. So let's get into it. Hold on. Let me put this light down. So let's say, CJ is so cool in trouble after royalty family confirmed Jaleel was touched. Let's see what he talking about. Let me find this part because I don't give a fuck about no karma and Corey. All right, here we go. All right, we about to start this bitch in three, two, and one. Well, three, two, one, go. All right. Two, in my previous video, I reported that they're beating again. CJ So Cool said that this is all for views, but it's looking like things are starting to get serious after CJ on 32 posts a text message from one of Royalty's children alleging that CJ So Cool has been touching Jalea for years. Now, supposedly, CJ So Cool was gifting Jalea toys in exchange for her silence. The text message also goes on to say that this is an open investigation that's being looked at currently. Now, the supporters are shocked and they have been commenting if this is so, why is Royalty allowing Cordea to go over there with CJ? so cool and if this is an active investigation did this just start or was this go hey that's true though that's not i'm not even gonna lie like that's really true though if see because i keep seeing this shit if see this if see this so cool is touching julia why why would royalty let the other kids go over there like that 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 generally don't make sense like if, if see this so cool is doing what he doing. Why is royalty letting the other kids go? Because I know me personally, y'all. Y'all know I'm always for the kids. You feel me? Like, I'm always for the kids. I know me personally. If I know that my baby father has been touching one of my kids, I'm not going to let him around no kids. Because if you do it to one person, you're going to do it to everybody. You feel me? So, that's kind of like, what? that don't even make sense. You feel me? That don't even make sense. Like... What is happening? On between Royalty and CJ for a while. And if so, why wasn't this mentioned during the court hearing when they was fighting for the twins? I'm not saying that one of the kids didn't text him. I would prefer to hear this from Jaleah Mouth strictly. This is definitely out of line to use this as a, ooh, I got one up on you type of situation. This is not no play play type of situation when you bring this out. Real quick, I'm jumping in because supposedly CJ on 32 is saying that Royalty's mom reached out to him recently and told him about this particular situation. Wait, so time out. So you telling me that... So you telling me that CJ So Cool touched Jaleel and Jaleel ain't said nothing yet? You feel me? So that's what you're telling me right now. Now, I'm going to keep it a band with y'all. You feel me? Y'all know I keep it real on here every time. I never cap on here. I don't have no reason to cap because what the fuck I'm going to get from that? You feel me? I keep it a band with y'all. So I'm not even going to lie. I, I, I've... I've experienced a lot of stuff in my life, you know, not, not saying me personally, like I went through this shit, but I know, I know people to this day, friends, family, I know people to this day, y'all, that then told me that they've been touched by, you know, people or told me that they went through shit. Like I literally have 
this shit has been in my face before. You feel me? I'm not even going to lie to y'all. This shit has been in my face before. And um, I just know anytime that shit has happened, like, people, like, the people that I've been around that has told me this shit, you feel me? And I hate getting on here telling people business, but I feel like I just have to share, I have to share this shit to y'all you know, so y'all can see, like, this shit is real life. Like, I've I've literally been around people who have told me, like, yeah, like, such and such did this to me, da, da, da. And I'm thinking, like, what? Like, it could not be possible. Like, who ever thought, like, and then when shit get brought to courts or when shit, you know, when they start doing DNA tests, when they start doing all that shit, it actually comes to the, it actually comes to the light. But it be having you wondering, like, it really be having you wondering, like, why people don't say this shit all along. You feel me? Like, like, like shit like this, it be like, why you didn't say this all along? Like, why didn't you been say this? Because it's like, it just don't make sense. It's like, why you just not saying this when shit is being brought to the light? You feel me? Like, that's how I be saying, like, it's like when people get on this internet and shit, it's like, they be saying shit once, like, a, a big old situation is about to happen. It's like when people, when people is in, in the dark, it's like that, it's like that's when they, like, try to put dirt on your name. You see what I'm saying? It's like, for what? You see what I'm saying? It's like, for what? Like, I, I, I'm just not under, like, I've literally witnessed, like, real life shit like this. You feel me? Like, when, like, I've literally been around people, like, I've literally, like, I ain't gonna say talk, like, I, bro, I don't wanna get on here and tell no business, but I've, I've, like, you know, witnessed this shit. You feel me? Like, I've literally witnessed this shit. And it's like, I, I'm just, it's gone. It's, now, y'all leave y'all comments down below. Like I said, I would prefer to hear this from Jaleah's mouth because this is getting way too messy. This ended up being a CJ on 32 versus CJ So Cool. And now a whole investigation. Lexi took to social media because now she's requesting for a lawyer because she want to sue CJ on 32. But you got Royalty's mom saying that this is true. I don't know. Y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all thinking when it comes to this. Did you hear me, my ex? Liking all the pictures saying join a winning team? Bro, you've always been weird to me. Ever since I seen what you did with Royalty and you tried to denounce it as, we just been cool this whole time. That was cap. <laughs> Anybody believe that? You're weird. You hanging out with your man's baby mamas who he's beefing with, literally spending hundreds of thousands of dollars to go against in court, battling all my I told y'all I'd be your own friends, bro. Y'all got to check y'all circles, bro. Like... Y'all gotta check y'all circles, bro. It be your own friends, I swear to God. Like, it really do. You feel me? Like, when you really sit back and you really think about shit, you be like, damn, motherfuckers was playing a role the whole time. Like, it really be your friends. You feel me? Like, that's why I tell people straight up, bro. Like, the best thing you can do, like, the best advice I can give y'all is just always be cautious like that's literally all i can tell people like all i can really tell people is just be cautious because you never know you never know people's true attentions you just never know you never know what somebody else could be you know like putting on your name you just never know because i know me personally like i know me personally bro if i got on here and told y'all like if I really sat on this bitch and told, like, I don't do this internet shit, so I don't care to do this, but I'm telling y'all, hypothetically speaking, if I was to get on here and literally sit here and tell y'all the shit that people done did, it would be over with. You feel me? It would literally be over with. You feel me? Like, it would literally be over with. But I don't do that because I'm not, I, I don't. I'm here to make y'all laugh and to entertain you. I'm not here to bring people down. I'm not here to, I'm not here to do that. You feel me? But obviously, you know, when people, you know, get on this, you know, when people, you know, try to, you know, do me wrong, obviously I'm going to speak my mind. Everybody have, everybody has a voice. You feel me? Like nobody, nobody is not, nobody in this world is uh forced to not speak. If you have something on your mind, speak it. You feel me? Like I tell people all the time, if you have shit on your mind, speak it. You feel me? Nobody... You feel me type shit. So it's like, y'all literally have to watch y'all friends, bro. Because it be y'all closest friends, especially in 2024, bro. It's a lot of it's a lot of snakes going on. It's a lot of weird shit going on. And it's like, if you don't watch your circle, bro. If you don't watch your circle, bro. You will literally get snaked out. You will get slimed out, for real. And I know this, I know this, y'all. Like, I know this. I've literally been in so many situations, y'all. Like, it's not even funny. Like, I literally have messages of people telling me, MK, thank you so much for looking out for me. Thank you so much. You was right all along. Thank you so much. Like, I don't, I tell people all the time, bro, I don't get paid for this shit. I don't get paid to help people at all. 
that's just the type of person that I am. You feel me? I don't get paid for this shit at all. Like, there's so many people in this world that I've helped, and they sit here and they act like, and they act like I don't help them. You feel me? They act like I don't be putting them on game and shit. I be telling these people, like, how this shit be going. And then as soon as it happens, y'all, that's when they be like, damn, okay, you was all alone. They, they was, you was all alone. Like, if I literally sat here and made a video of screenshots of people saying, thank you, MK, thank you, MK, MK, you was right this whole time, MK, I'm sorry, MK, MK, MK. Y'all will understand. But I don't, I'm not here to, I'm not here to gain that. You feel me? I'm not, like, you feel what I'm saying? Like, I'm not here to gain, like, oh, MK, like, I'm not like, oh, yeah, like, I told y'all niggas, da, da, da. I'm not here to say that. You feel me? Because I'm, I'm cool. You feel me? Like, I be cool. You feel me? I just be sitting over here like, Man, I told y'all. You feel me? I just be over here like, I try to tell you. You feel me? Like, that's all I be saying. I be like, I be trying to tell y'all. But, hey, it is what it is. You feel me? I just be want to motivate y'all and let y'all know shit. You feel me? Got into a shootout. We almost got jumped because she brought six people to kill me. And you siding with her saying, oh, we was cool to You was never cool with her. She was definitely not cool with you. She used to tell me all the time how fake you was. But back to the jury, because that's everybody's really main concern. They're like, where your jury at? First of all, I still have jury. The jury that I wanted to keep, I kept. And everything I didn't want, I sold. Let me tell you why. I'm scrolling on Instagram, and I see the price of gold just went up. The kilo is now a million dollars. I'm going to keep it a band, like... I'm going to keep it a band, you feel me? Because I'm, I'm, I ain't going to lie. But when it comes down to season so cool, like, I've always, like, I've always, like, watched him, you know, growing up. And I've always seen him around kids, like, I, like, you feel me? Like, you can tell, like, you can tell when people really be doing shit and you can tell when they don't be doing shit. You feel me? Like, you people be knowing. You feel me? Like, I feel like royalty, she dragging this shit. You feel me? She definitely dragging this shit because it's just like, at this point, what are you doing? You feel me? Like, what are you really doing? You feel me? But I'm not gonna lie. When it comes down to that jury shit, what he just said, because it said he explained why he saw his jury. Like, because I ain't gonna lie. I was wondering, too. I'm like, damn, where the fuck this nigga jury and shit go? I'm like, what the fuck? But I'm gonna keep it a man. Like, people, like, it's like, it, it, it be so funny to me because it's like the world, the way the world is, bro, is like, they they look at this social media stuff and they run with it. You feel me? Like, I'm not I'm not easily fooled. You feel me? Like, I look past shit. I, I, I know this shit. You feel me? But it's like people they get they they watch these people and they and they and they have these opinions on people and they don't be accurate. You feel me? Like me being me and me knowing how this shit going, it's like okay, like we obviously know CJ So Cool has money. Like let's be real. You feel me? He might not have the same money he had when he was with the kids. You feel me? Obviously because the kids played a big part in his channel. But it's like we all know deep down that shit that's so cool has money. You feel me? Like we all know that. You feel me? So it's, it, like you feel me? Like shit. Like it's like the the shit that just be going on, it just be so fucking stupid. And it, it just be dumb, y'all. Y'all, like, it just be so dumb to me. What does CJ say? Oh, this is great news to me. Ali, what up? I'm trying to say, oh, this jury, bro, this stuff that went up in value. Oh, well, CJ, actually, I scammed the freak out of you and your jury didn't go up at all. You actually lost the majority of the value. And now, you only got, like, 10% equity in your jury. So, I mean, basically, you got scammed. How do you want to go about it? We arguing on the phone. This is impossible. How is this? Well, your jury's 10 karat gold. Okay. This is my first time hearing about this. I didn't... I know some of y'all look at it. I never took off my chain, looked at the back and said, where's the engravings? What kind of gold is this? I didn't do that. I ain't gonna lie. If I had, if I had like some real, you know, some real pieces of shit, I ain't doing that shit either. You feel me? Like, I, like I ain't gonna lie. Like, if I go to Icebox and I spend a hundred thousand on a piece, I'm gonna expect for it to be motherfucking real. Like, I'm not gonna just look at no chain and do all that shit. What? I'm paying this money. I'm thinking it is what it is. You feel me? But then again, it's like you, you gotta, you gotta be smart with your purchases. You feel me? Like, you gotta know what you buy. You feel me? So at the same time, it's like, it's like, hey, you feel me? Like, you gotta, you gotta, you know. Sometimes you do gotta take that L. You feel me? See, I told y'all. I told y'all, bro. Sometimes, bro, message us today, bro. Sometimes y'all need to take that ill, bro. Like, sometimes y'all have to take that motherfucking ill. Like, y'all literally have to take that ill. Because it's like, when it all comes down to it, bro, y'all people be knowing what they doing. I, I, bro, people, I, I'm telling y'all this shit, bro. I'm telling y'all this shit. I'm literally telling y'all this shit. So, long story short, the jury that I had wasn't worth anything. More specifically, I paid 100000 for a chain, right? He said it was worth seven k 
That's crazy as fuck. I'm not walking around with this in my head saying it looks good, it costs a lot, but it's seven a hundred K just for it to be worth seven bands. <laughs> hey, I ain't gonna lie. If I spend a hundred K on some jewelry and, and I and I find out that this is worth seven K on my soul, they better run me my money back. You hear me? I I'll, I'll fuck around loot that whole bitch out. You hear me? I'm not even gonna lie. Let me find out that I done paid a hundred thousand and whole time my shit worth seven K. Listen, listen, boy, I swear to God, I've probably been in, man, what? Y'all know I'll play with my money, you hear me? So just imagine, if you if you drop a hundred thousand on a chain, you feel me? You rocking that motherfucker, yeah, like poppy your one, two. You, you turn that shit in, because you, I don't know, you might want to get a new chain, you feel me? You might want to cash that in and get another chain, or you might want to just get your money. And they and they had the ring and they had the counter any type of shit and they like, oh, this only worth seven k. That's just like for instance with me, like I had a camera, right, y'all? I had a camera, boy. I spent by that camera probably like eight nine hundred dollars. You feel me? I had a camera eight hundred nine hundred dollars. I had like three lenses that was all worth four. Like one lens was worth four hundred, the other one was like two hundred, the other one was like the other one was like one sixty. I go to the camera store and I'm like, yeah, y'all, like, I'm trying to trade this in so I can get a Sony, you feel me? Because I want a little small camera. I'm probably just going to end up buying a camera. But I'm like, I want a little Sony camera. So I'm like, y'all can have all this because I don't want this shit no more because I don't, I don't want the big old camera. I'm like, I'm about to trade all this in for this. Boy, they got the ring and shit up. They like, uh, yeah, so the Sony camera, it costs like $900. They like, when you trade all this in, this is only worth $300. What? You telling me all of this stuff that I just gave you? I done gave y'all three camera lenses. I gave y'all a big ass camera that's not even in a game that everybody wants. And you tell me that's worth three hundred dollars? Give me my shit. I literally said, "Oh, this is it." I grabbed all my shit, put it in my bag, and I walked to the car. You feel me? You know what? I'm not gonna give you all of this that's worth. Like you feel me? Like people be out here playing. I'm not gonna give you all of this that's worth all this money just for you to tell me that I only can't, that I only got three hundred dollars. What out of all of that? No. What? What did you talk about? You must be crazy and you drunk. That nigga need to get fired. If I see him to this damn boy, I might go to his manager. I'm going to the GM. You hear me? His money on top of my jewelry and then give it to you guys. Cause then y'all y'all would be literally winning. Because if you get it for free, then you're winning. But if you pay what I paid, you got scammed. <laughs> I thought everybody knew this about Sometimes you got to the hell. Top jeweler at any day, bro. If you're not making a jury, you're not going. to Get what you pay for it, bro. I thought everybody, that's what everybody agreed on. If it's not, like, if you're not buying gold, like, actual, like, gold, then you're just buying, like, diamonds. Hey, I thought everybody do that when buying jewelry. Apparently not. That's why I don't really buy jewelry, though. You feel me? Like, that's why y'all probably would never in y'all life see me, like, buy no big pieces. Like, I, you feel me? Like, I'll probably buy, like, a little, you know, a little one, two little piece. But you ain't gonna never see MK cashing out on no jewelry because, like, Boy, I don't, I don't play like that. I put my money to use. You hear me? Like I, I spend that bitch on a vacation. I spend that shit on, on people. Like I don't, I don't do that shit. Like that little shit don't even be. That shit don't even be that deep to me. You feel me? They don't even be that deep. Now let's talk about DDG because he tells the truth about the cherry situation and what. Dang, so that's it, y'all. I'm not even gonna lie, man. What y'all think about that? Do y'all think that royalty line? If y'all ask me, you feel me? Because y'all know one thing about him, cash. She gonna keep it a band. If y'all ask me. I feel like I feel like royalty is dragging it. I feel like she's just trying to. Uh, this is how I. If y'all want me to be honest, this is how I feel. I feel like when people see that something don't stop you, it's like they try everything in their power to tear you down. You feel me? Like see this so cool. He up the he up the new girl. He went he 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 still cool with his baby mama. So it's like when it all comes down to it. It's like that really made her mad. So it's like the only thing she could possibly do is say shit about somebody. You feel me? Like that's how this shit go. Like if you don't, if you, if you, if you take an elbow, all you can do is just talk shit. Like that's literally all you can do. You feel me? So it's like I just genuinely feel like with royalty, but she just she she's gassing that shit. You feel me? She's gassing it. But you do never know though. You feel me? You never know. You feel me? So it's like if she is telling the truth. Like, hey, I feel bad for Jaleel, you feel me? Hopefully she seek the shit that she looking for. Hopefully she get peace from that because, like I said, I have no per I know people personally that, you know, went through that shit, you know, and, you know, they still have past traumas for that shit. Like, I literally have someone to this day, like, 
Bro, it, it's, it's really sad when you think about it. It's really sad. Like, that's not even a topic to play around with. Like, I, I, I don't take nothing. Like, I, I don't take that shit lightly. Like, I, I really, because I'm always for the people. And I'm always, like, you y'all know me, bro. I'm always trying to, like, lift people up and try to, like, you know, see through shit. So, it's like, if Jalea is being real, like, that's that's really messed up. You feel me? That, that's that's really messed up. And that's, a, that's definitely crazy. But I genuinely don't think that... I don't think that. You feel me? I genuinely don't think that. I would have to... I would literally have to see proof of that shit. Like, I would have to see, like, medical, you know, shit being done. Or, I don't know. Like, what did he even do? Like, when she said he touched her, what do we mean? Like, did he, did he touch her on the arm? Did he... Like, what did he do? Like, they're not even... Like, did they say what he... Where he touched her? Or what did he... Like, what is they... I don't understand this shit. You feel me? I don't understand this. But I don't think CSO so cool did that, y'all. I mean, keep it a band. I don't think he did that. But... Y'all can uh, let me know in the comments section what y'all think about this. Make sure y'all like the video, subscribe to the channel, turn y'all post notifications on so you guys know notified for every single video. And I will see y'all in the next video, y'all. I will be probably going to Atlanta uh in the next couple of days. So um be on the lookout for those vlogs. You feel me? Be on the lookout for those vlogs because like I told y'all, I had a family member that just passed, and so we are going to see her. So uh keep MK and y'all prayers, y'all. Keep MK and her all prayers because a lot is going on right now. But Without further ado, y'all will see you on the next video. I love y'all and I'm out, y'all. Peace.